This video is brought to you by Azista's Breathe Easy Mask. These masks are made up of special skin fabric and also comes with adjustable neck straps and have a very cool design. Check description for more information. Hi guys, I'm Shamit Sayed and you're watching PC Media and in this video, I'm going to be sharing you a very easy solution to get exact same resolution if you're trying to connect an external monitor to your laptop or PC. So without any further ado, let's get started. Okay guys, the fix is really simple and the solution revolves around a setting in your graphic cards control panel and uh, for AMD this setting is known as virtual uh, super resolution and for NVIDIA this setting is known as dynamic super resolution. Honestly, I, I am not an AMD user so I don't know much about these settings on an AMD's laptop but since I'm using an NVIDIA's enabled laptop, I would be showing how it's done on an NVIDIA's enabled laptop. Now, once you have logged in into your laptop, you just have to go to your uh, NVIDIA's control panel. Uh, once you have opened your NVIDIA's control panel, you just have to go to change resolution under display settings and select the display that you want to uh, change the resolution for. Now in this case I have connected an Sony TV as an external monitor so I would be choosing Sony TV and now un you would be having some settings like uh, the connector which is the HDMI port that I have used to connect my TV with my laptop and the refresh rate and the dynamic super resolution settings. Under dynamic super resolution settings you would be having a bunch of resolution settings that you can choose and work with. Now. Uh, for default uh, or by default these settings would be on 1360 into 768 pixels uh, and um, now you can change it to 1080p uh, from the ultra hd options now guys one thing which is very important is that your tv should be enabled with hd resolution options so that you can select the hd uh, options on your tv if your tv is not enabled with hd resolution you won't be able to work on hd on your tv since my TV is uh, enabled with HD, I have selected HD and I have applied that settings on my TV. Now uh, one thing which is very good about these settings is that you can also work on higher resolution through the settings. For that, uh, once you go to Windows 10 settings, under Windows 10 settings if you go to your system and uh, you go to display. Uh, you can choose this display uh, like second is the TV display that I'm using so once I click on second and I go to the display resolution option you can see I have a bunch of mode resolution here and I have selected 2k resolution for my TV so you can work on a higher resolution uh, also with this with these settings now if you want 1920 into 1080p you can select that uh, I'm working on 27 15 into 15 27 because that helps me uh, in enhancing my editing experience so I have selected that and you can work with display orientation and all of that stuff that you want to so guys that's it for this tutorial I hope you find this video helpful and uh, if you are new to our channel I would suggest you to subscribe to our channel for more such tutorials unboxings and reviews uh, regularly that are uploaded on my channel and uh, if you want to get notified for those videos just click on uh, the bell icon so that you get notified and if you like this video then do hit the like button and also follow us on instagram with the link in the description with that being said, thank you for watching and if you are an AMD user, I have linked an article on how to do this same method on your AMD's laptop. Uh, just go to that link and get your problem rectified. Without any further ado, let's get off this video. Adios.